My name is Maria and I'm going to walk you through on how I restore my Barbie's plane. What makes this plane very special is that they don't do more of these planes anymore. So it's an old plane that's 21 years old. The plane was in really bad conditions. The first thing I'm going to clean is the inside of the plane. The color of the plane was originally blue, but you can tell there's some yellowish around because it's too old. The best way to clean the plane, it will be doing circular motion with the toothbrush. That way everything, it starts to come up. And because I'm using the dish soap, if there's something greasy on the plane, it's gonna take it out. The biggest issue with restoring this plane are the stickers because you can barely see what is on them. For removing the stickers, I'm gonna use this red spatula that is made of plastic silicone and very gently I'm gonna go through like the windows and all the parts that have sticker residue. It's extremely important that we remove completely every residue. If not, the primer will not stick well. And we're gonna see painting of the primer like breaking and then not even the sandpaper is gonna take that out. So we have to be very, very careful in this part. After cleaning and removing all the stickers, it's very important to put this primer before the spray paint because this is gonna let the other paint to stick much better. We don't wanna spray a lot of layers on the plane, otherwise it wouldn't like open well or track well. We're just gonna put two coats, one the primer and then the spray paint. The reason why I chose the spray paint is because it sticks very well on the plastic. The spray technique, it's pretty much just going from the far, never close, and from left to right, very patient, so it doesn't drip. The plane originally is made of plastic and it has no paint. The plastic was originally blue. So it was a challenge because it's not gonna be like 100% how it was before, but it's gonna be very, very close. For the pink chairs, I'm gonna mix two colors, uh, white and red, and then I'm gonna put it in an airbrusher so I can spray them all around. What is gonna take me most of the time is actually doing or rebuilding the stickers. I was trying to find the stickers everywhere, websites, internet, and I couldn't find anything. So that's why I decided to do it by myself. I had to print them in two different papers. The first, it's gonna be on a white background. That was very useful for the stickers that were on the windows, the ones in the tail that has like the Barbie logo and everything. And then for the flowers, because the blue behind the flowers was the original blue, it was really hard to match the spray paint that I, that I used. So I just went through a transparent background so you can see the flowers, but you can also see through them and see like this beautiful new blue from the spray paint. To remember uh, how or where to put all these stickers and not to miss anything, I want to say I looked to the pictures and I made my research, but honestly I played so much with this plane that it was all in my mind and I knew exactly which stickers I had to make or where to put them.